Hello folks, welcome back to our channel. My name is Jana Adams and with me I have just me today. So Bren is already in bed. It's about 6.30 on Sunday night and we don't have any videos. So I wanted to hop on here. You might start to see a few more videos with just me and them as she tends to go to bed early and we sometimes have trouble coordinating our busy weekend schedules to get videos done. So with that said, I do have a few boxes here of some different things, including one from our buddy Brighton, which I'm very excited about. So we are um, happy hour haulers, part-time reseller, uh, Full-time, I work in the banking industry. Bryn is a plant manager in food manufacturing, and I like to uh, dabble on the side reselling. She likes the sourcing aspect of it, and she really enjoys the videos, but the rest of it, she can kind of leave. Not really her favorite. So, um, this is a box, first off, that I wanted to open. We had been sourcing a lot on ThreadUp. We really are not sourcing much on ThreadUp anymore. We, um, we do have some fun boxes still at our storage unit that eventually, we have a climate controlled storage unit because we live in North Carolina and it is hot and humid here. But we got a climate controlled storage unit and took a bunch of stuff over there including some fun boxes. So at some point we'll open up some really, really old fun boxes. That should be a lot of fun. Um, but in the interim, I wanted to show you guys what I pick up sourcing in different avenues. So it's everything from Poshmark. We do uh, sourcing pretty consistently now on Poshmark for reselling. Uh, we go to the bins, but have not been in a very long time. Thread up again, but kind of on a break with them. And a lot of whatnot. So a lot of what you'll see in our videos right now, at least, is going to be whatnot and Poshmark. But this particular one is a very exciting box from our friend Brighton. And um, I know about one or two things in here but definitely I'm expecting some surprises because he is a very generous and dear friend and that's how he is. So this is the first thing that I knew that I was getting and this is the thing that I'm most excited about. This is a vintage coach and it is what they call a chunky case. And it is a very popular SLG. SLG stands for small leather good. And um, and this one will be, um, I believe, a keeper for our collection. It's got the blue and tick, uh, blue and white tick lining, which is classic coach. And there's my creed on that. And he got this for a steal of a deal. In fact, I'm a little blown away by it. and it has the original paperwork in it. So that is absolutely insane and very, very exciting. And he sent me a text and said, he knows that we love Vintage Coach and said, is this what you like? And I said, oh my God, please get that immediately. And so then we also have, oh my God, Gosh, that's beautiful. I do not know about this piece. Let me take this bracelet off so that we can see this piece in all of its glory. Holy cow, look at that, guys. Oh my gosh. Oops, there we go. And let's see if it fits. He knows that we have a larger, or that I have a larger wrist size, and oh my God, it's beautiful. Oh my God, it's so gorgeous. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Oh my God, Brighton. Whew, that's a good one. 
then we have some uh looks like a uh, lip mask apply mask yep it's a lip mask very nice very thoughtful gift to give to reselling friends because we all know that we never stop to take time to pamper ourselves then we have a charcoal sheet mask Ooh, and sandalwood oh my gosh he must have known because we've talked about loving sandalwood and then thank you cards we can always use those that's always a nice thoughtful gift and thank you stickers i love that when we get packages from him they're filled with thoughtful th tools for reselling always a really nice touch and then oh oh i have to sneeze so i'll have to edit my sneezing out sorry about that guys all right then we have what looks like bag chains and we can always use these and I'm gonna open one up and we'll see yes they are so they are um, bag chains that we can add to bags that are missing their longer strap so that is and we've got them in two in a gold tone and one that's in a silver tone those always come in handy this is a great little fun box thank you brighton okay then we have this says charisma This changes everything. <gasps> oh my gosh, they look like my chameleon. I collect from Bryn's mom chameleon jewelry, and I think that these are chameleon. No, they're a little different on the back. I wonder though. So it's, sorry. So it is these chameleon looking charms with the chameleon jewelry. It is um, jewelry where you'll have like a sterling silver band and it'll have a center stone and the center stone can be interchanged with other pieces. So I'll definitely be excited to look into that. Then, oh, pearl earrings. He knows that I am a pearl girl. These are beautiful. Oh my gosh, I love them. Some really nice pearls. And just a really classic creamy pearl color. Ooh, and he also knows that we love bone. And I think that this is bone, guys. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Oh. Oh, it's two. It's two different necklaces. Look at how pretty those are. Those are beautiful. And it looks like sterling silver in between. It has that buttery feel to it. Those are really nice. And I'm still going, guys. Okay, we have two more bags, it, it feels like. So we have a coach. It's a two-way bag with the longer strap and then the, uh, the satchel-type strap. And it is the Scribble from, I believe that this is either Coach Poppy or Op Art. I'm not really sure. And it is not a factory bag, but it does have the bullseye stamp on it, which means that it was made for retail and eventually either was a final sale piece or went to the outlet. And this one just needs a really good cleaning and I am the person for that. So excited about that one. And last piece, guys. 
Oh, that is beautiful. Dooney and Burke. Wow. What a pretty bag. Sorry, I'm about to show it. I, I wanted to, it's got the little key, um, the little, uh, what's the word for it? I can't think of the word for it, but it's the key dangle. And we've got Dooney and Burke right there on the back in a classic yellow with a long shoulder or crossbody strap. And I love this smooth leather. It reminds me of Vintage Coach. And it is in beautiful condition, guys. Oh, this is such a cool piece. This is such a, a coach style to like a vintage coach style, but Dooney and Burke. And then we do have the luggage tag there. Love this bag. So Brighton, thank you so much. This was really fun to open. So um, yeah, we've got the two bags, our chunky case, which I'm most excited about. That piece is absolutely incredible. Then we've got thank you cards and reseller stuff and stickers and mask and lip mask and all kinds of fun stuff there. And then of course our jewelry pieces. So that's super fun. So I'm gonna stick that to the side. Thank you again so very much. And then next up we have, a lot of these I had to open just to make sure that everything was um, in acceptable condition but I have not uh, thoroughly looked at them. I wanted there to still be that element of surprise, but WhatNot has changed their return policy recently to where if you need to return a piece, um, you have, I think, three or seven days, and that's it, to return an item. Otherwise, it's just like Poshmark, where after a certain period of time, um, you don't have that option anymore. So this is a, and this is a little sticky, I'm not gonna lie. Um, this is not from one of our normal um, sellers that we buy from, but the good news is that I bought the bag for the strap. We had a um, musette. I think that it was the musette that, no. Uh, Hello, folks. There she is. Hello, folks. There she That's is. A nice strap. Isn't so it? I needed a black strap for a bag that we had, and I think that I got this one for thirty-eight dollars for the bag and the strap, and I bought it knowing that I was buying it for the strap. She said that the bag was in okay condition, pretty good. I'm not thrilled with how it's feeling. It's a little sticky, but anyway. What do you think of our new filming spot? I like our new filming spot. I like our living room. We don't wear, we don't often. We don't film. often spend time in here. We don't here. spend time in here. We don't film in here, but we should. We should. I like it in here. We do have a nice living room. Well, we, we, do. we do. We do. Um, so we're normally in the kitchen. <laughs> and I didn't have the heart to kick la two weekends ago when we did some videos. Uh, we kicked Frank out. And I didn't have the heart to do it again. So here we are. Here <laughs> we are. In a change of scenery. So uh, this is from our buddy Akita. We all know and love her. We've done quite a few videos with them. And let's see what we got on this day. So we have, I think that this one, why do I think that they gave us this? Oh no. Oh no. We bought one thing. Oh, yeah, we did not pay for that. That was just a generous freebie. Maybe they gave it to us because of because they love us or because of, um, oh, no. Hey, Frank. Oh, that's here, right. Hey, Frank. Oh, here. Frank. Come here. Hold on. Let me see if I can get him in the Come camera. Here. It shouldn't be hard. Come here. There he is. <laughs> hey, Frank. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> What's going on, Frank? What are you, he's so confused by us being in here. 
Does he have a bone in here? No. Frank, come on. Come on, I'll get you a bone. Come on, Frank. Come on, Frank. He's like, no way. <laughs> Where's she going? Bone, right Where's she going? I'll give you a bone, buddy. You a good boy. You a good boy. Thank you. Okay, so. Huh. <laughs> I dropped some stuff. So, yeah, we were uh, going to do it in the kitchen. Do our video in the kitchen like normal. And Frank was in there. And I just didn't have the heart. So, we are a very odd, weird family. And we watch TV in the kitchen. We have a big TV over our fireplace in the kitchen, and that's where we choose to watch TV. And uh, and so, yeah, that's what we're doing, is we're doing a video in the living room so that Frank can watch TV in the kitchen. And this one, I've got to uh, wax up this zipper a little bit. So my zipper is a little Good bit morning, everyone. Welcome to part six uh, sticky my... on this one. But Bryn loved this. There were a couple of small marks on it but I do love it but such a great size it's definitely um you know pink gingham is my jam a pretty big um size for a wristlet perfect pouch for her cords and stuff like that and then these they just I guess sent unless they were maybe I, I don't know They're oh my gosh this was yes Oh, this was so cute. Okay, gotta it's figure out jacket. how to show this. It is a dog jacket. So a North Face dog jacket for Frankie. I don't know if it's backwards for you guys. I think that it will be, but it says the dog face. How stinking cute is this? So and cute. Don't do that. Her no. or per PME. It was just adorable. So cute. And they have seen Frankie in our videos, and um, we talk about Frankie, and so they threw that in our package for us. And then we also have this bag, which I'm not familiar with. This is Mandarina Duck, designed in Italy, original Italian leather. And the hardware on this thing is so nice. I've never heard of this brand. I saw the brand. Mandarina Duck. And it looks like it's in like new condition. I'm excited to look this up. Even the, um, the clasps have that kind of whatever that's called, the anchor um, clasp pretty bag and it's a fully adjustable strap i like that bag that is a really nice bag that breathing folks is frankie not me the what his breathing do you not hear him like <laughs> no okay and the last one that we have is all right, all right. a box from a random seller that we popped into their show and i have the pricing here for it We did, we did pay up for one of the items in here. So this she has loaded with stuff, but we have the coach backpack. We got a pretty good deal on this one. So we'll be passing along a good deal to subscribers if anyone is interested. Corners look good. There's a slight, Frankie. there's a slight smell. Frankie. Hey. Hey, you're a menace. Come here. Can you just be <laughs> sweet? So this is what you guys don't get to see because we're in the kitchen chairs. It looks like there's a slight smudge there that I can try to get off. But other than that, it looks good on the outside. My zippers look good. Oh, I'm missing. Oh, that's kind of a bummer. I'll have to go back to our video receipt and look. 
we're missing, if you see here, the H on coach is partially broken off. Hopefully you can see that. I'm not used to filming this way. I'm just used to saying, Bryn, can you see that? And then she says yes or no. That works a lot better for me. Okay. So that's the backpack. Oh, inside. Uh -oh. oh boy. Looks very clean. I'm not going to be able to show you guys, but it's clean. And <laughs> Shake. Shake. Other paw. Thank you. Down. He doesn't like down. 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 Thank you. Stay. He doesn't know stay. <laughs> and there it is. <laughs> oh, he's got a bone. <laughs> okay, we have this. Um, one of our friends, Crystal, KB Bag Chick on whatnot collects this style of wristlet so i got one of these because i thought that she was starting to collect them again and i was going to give it to her but then she sold the one that she said that she was going to start collecting <laughs> so we'll be selling this one unless of course she watches our video and sees it and says oh my gosh i've got to have it but it is clean inside it's like new inside well, maybe a couple of little marks, and I can try to work on those. Silver tone hardware. It's a black with a silver and gray. Pretty wristlet. Then we got, and I got these purely to resell. Um, we purchased two pair of, sorry if that's loud for you guys. Oh, me? No. Oh, okay. The plastic. I was getting an old Roy one because that seems to work. Two pair of Christian Dior vintage dress socks. But we got them for cheap enough. I think that we got them for... I think that they comped at about 50 and we got them for $11. So I thought that was pretty good. And then... Man, I loaded up with this person. Oh, I remember this. Okay, so we got this uh, Aqua Bomb Hydrating Body Moisturizer. That sounded fun to put in the bathroom. And then we also got, I can't wait to use these. I've never tried them before. Has anybody ever tried? Oh boy. That was Frankie. <laughs> How does stuff just make noise in here um these are aromatherapy shower steamers and i've never tried them they were uh a dollar and i thought well gosh that would be fun to have in the shower and they are eucalyptus and mint lavender citrus and rose and then the last thing that we got from the seller she was just selling a whole bunch of random stuff and i was there for it we won this giveaway which was just a um an unbranded pink faux leather wallet nice compact size but this was the main thing that i was after no hang tag it is a um i believe that it is a scooter Bryn, it's nine nine seven eight do you mind looking it up nope. but it is this it looks like mahogany color Uh, coach bag. It sidekick? looks. Oh, is it a sidekick? Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Well, I'm getting scooter and sidekick. There's definitely some scuffing right there on this the back. This a scooter. But it's not through the leather. It's just superficial. And I should be able to get that out. So that's a fun piece. There is quite a bit of verdigris which is that green goopy stuff that's in that turn lock area. I don't know if you can see that. 
but great bag. I think that this one I paid somewhere around 44 if I looked at my receipt correctly. But this was the what took me to the auction. And then I was able to, since I had already purchased some of the other items, I was able to, uh, to get reduced shipping on the other items, which made it make sense. So that is our haul for today. Let us know what you think. And thank you so much for watching. Bryn, thanks for coming down. Thank you. I'm sorry I was late. Thank you. Thanks, guys. And we will see you on the next video. It will probably be, hopefully, more of stuff like this. More of our whatnot finds and treasures. And thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you next time. Thanks.